When a Tanda questionnaire has been published to us for us to fill out the answers, you will be notified through email and at the same time you can also come into your Dustbase account, click at projects, click at questionnaires. So you will see the list of questionnaires that have been published in this page. For example, if you have 10 projects with 10 published questionnaires, you will see all the 10 projects over here. Right. So over here, I have one project which the questionnaire has been published to me. So I want to answer my questionnaire. So we click at the project name here and now you direct me to the questionnaire page. So we have the project details. Scroll down, you can see all your questions. So we have question 1, question 2, question 3, question 4, and you can see all the questions if there are more questions here. Right. So there's a few types of questions that can happen or that you'll be receiving. One is a text type so you will just answer based on text and then if you want to upload any supporting attachments you can upload also so for example let's say here um we want to answer then we just put in our answers here in the form of text so we have this provide list of names who will be involved as part of project team so you can input all their names with their rules okay so for example project manager who is the name and then all the other bits over here then we just have to click save once you have done filling up so you can see submitted at but this will only submit one question so each of our questions we have to click save accordingly so if we want to upload any attachments we click attachments here then we can click upload add files Then we can select our file, for example, let's say additional documents here, click open, click start upload, and submit. Then just to be safe, we click save. Right? So that's one question. Another type is more to multi-select. Multi-select means you can select more than one answer. So for example, let's say please stay on previous project experience. So we have experience in residential building. We have experience in institutional and commercial building and also infrastructure and heavy construction. So you can just take accordingly. If you want to upload attachments, you can do so. If not, we just click save. Right. And then another form is just an attachment only. So you won't be able to fill up or, or select anything. You can just upload attachments here. Right. So the same process, we click upload and then you can upload the relevant documents here. Okay, so let me just show example, click upload, click add files, so it be set for example, start upload, submit. So you will have the uploaded here. So if you want to delete also, you can still delete, right? And then the last type of questions that you can receive is a single select kind of question. So it's something like this, you will see um, a radio button here. Please confirm your proposed standard fee is inclusive of all works stated in Scopeworks. So you can either tick yes or no. So you can only select one answer. You won't be able to select more than one answer. Right. So all of this is just a sample questions. Do take note the questions will be subject to whatever questions that your clients have. Right. So we click save. Right. So I fill up all of my questions and then I have answered everything. So once we have answered all of our questions here and then we want to notify to our clients, then we can just scroll up, click at this notify button, which is please click notify once you have answered all the questions and ready to submit to our person in charge for review. So we click notify, right? And then once you click notify, it will show you successfully notified PIC about the questionnaire replies. Right, so that means that the PIC for this project have already been notified on the questionnaire reply so they can start to evaluate already. Okay, so that's how you fill up your questionnaire and then that's how you notify the PIC on your answers or replies.